What's up guys, welcome back. Today I'm sharing my makeup collection with you guys. I recently went through my makeup and organized everything, got rid of a lot of things that were old and expired. And if you follow me on Snapchat, you might have seen some stuff there. But anyway, I'm finally done and I wanted to share this with you guys and hopefully help you guys organize your own collection. So yeah, hopefully this video inspires you. And without further ado, let's begin. That's my desk where I edit most of my videos and then the two drawers are both from Ikea. It's called the Alex drawer, I believe, and um, I'll try and find and link it for you guys. But it's pretty much the same thing a lot of YouTubers have. It's really convenient for storing makeup because you just have tons of drawers and it really fits a lot. This uh, desk over here is pretty much just like a background desk. So that gold perfume bottle is from Home Goods, and then I just have a couple of books underneath. I have a candle, a lamp, again from Home Goods, and then this uh, plastic container holds a lot of hair ties and some bangles and jewelry that I usually wear on a daily basis. So on top of these desks, I usually keep some lipsticks, my brushes, and some pencils. This is just a cute little candle and of course a lamp and a mirror. So the way I like to organize my drawers is by section. So this is basically where I hold all my lipsticks and as you can see it's not full because I actually went over my drawers recently and kind of organized everything, got rid of a lot of things that were old and kind of expired. So these are just my lipsticks and I pretty much use them all. These are all like color lipsticks from NYX and then these are just like lipsticks from pretty much all over. And then this is where I hold the lip glosses and I try and organize them by brands if I can. That way it's easier to find things. So the second drawer is where I hold all of my eye products like mascaras and loose eyeshadows, primers, even some gel liners and everything pretty much related to eyes. So I even have like contacts in the back and all sorts of things. So this drawer, no matter how much you try and organize it, it always ends up looking kind of like messy because there's just so much going on. This is a drawer where I hold a lot of like new things that come in. So this is just a lot of like buxom stuff that I recently got that I have to go over. So the third drawer is probably my favorite. This is where I hold all of my foundations and concealers. And I love foundation just because I'm such a crazy skin person. For drugstore, I love the True Blend. And then um, my, my everyday foundation is the Giorgio Armani that's just, you know, gives me good coverage. Everything has to be flat, side by side. Things need to be very visible for me. That way I know exactly what I have because I want to be able to pull a product by just seeing it. I don't want to have to like dig through things to find it. And then this drawer over here holds a lot of like um, translucent powders and um, primers and things like that. So basically just for the skin. So I have a lot of primers here. I have a, a moisturizer, some wipes. I have some powders including like pressed powders and translucent powders. The fourth drawer is where I hold all of my blushes and bronzers. So this is where I hold all my blushes and then this is where I like to keep my bronzers and highlighters. So all my matte bronzers, shimmery, as well as all of the highlighters. I like to uh, keep these next to each other just because I feel like they kind of go together. So if I'm pulling a highlighter, I want to know what blush to pick with it and what bronzer. So it's kind of nice that they're right next to each other. So then this drawer over here holds all of my palettes. I love this drawer because it makes it easy to see what I want to work with. This side I keep all of the palettes that I use often. So I've got my Naked palettes, I've got my Lorac Pro. Right under that I have a palette that I made with MAC eyeshadows as well as some blushes. And then I have the Chocolate palettes by Too Faced. And then over here, I've got more Too Faced palettes. I've got some Hourglass palettes. So this is the section where I keep a lot of the uh, smaller palettes. So this is great for traveling and things like that. So this is where I keep a lot of my lashes and this is a bigger drawer. So all of the drawers above this are smaller and then this is a little bit deeper. So I like to keep all of my false lashes in here. And then right next to my lashes, I keep more palettes and things that I don't use as much. So a lot of like colorful things. Um, I've got Bare Minerals. I've got the Makeup Geek palette, which is awesome. I actually made that myself with all the colors that I chose. And then the Naked on the Run, which is great for traveling. And then I've got Vice right under it. These are tanning products that 
don't necessarily belong there, but somehow it ended up there. So what's great about this drawer unit is that the first five drawers are smaller, and then after that it gets deeper, so you get four deeper drawers. And so I like to keep a lot of like bigger items or just a lot of items in the deeper drawers. And so this side over here keeps all of my hair stuff. So I have a hairspray, I've got some oils, just everything that you can think of. When it comes to hair, I keep in this drawer. On this side over here, I like to keep just random things like my brush cleaner, my, my towel that I use to clean my brush, and then things that I don't necessarily use often. The last four drawers is where I keep a lot of my extra products, so brand new products. And this is pretty much where I pull a lot of my giveaways from. So um, every time I host a giveaway on my blog, it's usually pulling from these drawers and things that I have extras of so yeah be sure you are subscribed to my blog if you want to win some of these goodies right over here so that right there is another drawer where I keep a lot of extras and then the one on the left is where I keep a lot of my makeup bags so if I'm traveling and I need a makeup bag I kind of just pull from this section so that's pretty much it as you can see the last four drawers are deeper so that's kind of where I put a lot more products and then everything above that is a little bit thinner which is nice because it keeps things very kind of organized and there's just a lot of space so you're not overwhelmed looking for things. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to see more videos from me, be sure to subscribe to my channel. And if you want to see this makeup tutorial, check the blog tomorrow. I will have this video up on the 5 Minute Friday page. So be sure to check that out. I will see you guys very soon. Bye!